Pippen Sports, because your news team matters. Making sure the losses stay on the football field tonight, Milwaukee County Sheriff's deputies are extending their watch for drivers under the influence. Now, normally the patrols are focused on Friday and Saturday, but you can add tonight and to the effort because of the Super Bowl, of course. Jeremy Ross is near I-43 with details. Well, sports celebrations and suds, they're a natural pairing in this community, and the hope is that those two things don't further mix with drinking and driving on the interstates. It's a Super Bowl or a sports bar. We look forward to it. No matter the score, Milwaukee's major Goolsbees wins. The big game provides an additional sales boost, but bartender Brian Lux says it also provides some additional concerns. Making sure people aren't drinking too much, we're not over serving. While he does his part, Milwaukee County law enforcement is doing theirs. They've conducted drinking and driving patrols, arresting dozens on the interstate since the new year. The efforts typically take place on Friday and Saturday nights, but on Super Sunday, those patrols. Are extended. It was the worst experience of my life, man, to be honest with you. It is an you effort know, Rafael Rosales is all too familiar with. I had about six beers. Should you yeah. have been on the road? No, I shouldn't have been on the road. Rosales is not alone. We knocked on door after door of accused OWI offenders caught up with Rosales in early January. He was upset at how law enforcement treated him, but just as frustrated about his own decisions. At the time, law enforcement accused him of his fourth DUI. Court records show he was charged January 16th with refusal to take an intoxication test after his arrest. I was in custody for two days, man, and it was two days of hell. What's to say you're not going to do this again? The reality is that it's time for me to change my life, man. I'm 40 years old, man. I'm not getting any younger. And it comes to this point where if I catch a fifth of you at the DWI, I know the cop, the judge is going to be leaning into me. He's going to be, he's going to throw a book at me. It's so easy just to call a cab. Uh, bartenders, waitresses, everybody's always very open to calling you a cab. A celebration on Sunday where fans and deputies hope the only loss suffered is on the football field rather than on the roads. They have dinner, drink some beer. You know, that doesn't get too crazy. Now, last year, Milwaukee County Sheriff's deputies tell us they issued more than 960 citations for drinking and driving. We should get a better idea about those numbers over this past weekend as early as tomorrow. We're live near the interstate. Jeremy Ross, Fox 6 News. All right, Jeremy, thank you. You know, besides libations, the must-have on Super Bowl Sunday, of course, food.